Hey Taurus, this is your reading for August. And the Nine of Pentacles came out down here, which really goes with a self-reliance card. Relying on yourself, loving yourself. She really looks like she's loving herself there. So you'll probably just be enjoying your own company and somehow relying on yourself. Maybe a lot of you are single and like to be that way. But we have forgiveness and someone wants to make up with you. Those two kind of go together. If you want to make up with someone, sometimes you have to forgive. Forgive and forget. So it's time to forgive. There's a couple of cards here that tell me that you could have some options in love. There could be a fire sign or someone that stands for a masculine. It almost looks like he has to go through some kind of grieving process before he hooks up with you and dates you, comes back to you, whatever the case is. It looks like, yeah, he's going through something right now and it's about to be over. He's about to go through this grieving process and then, and then he's on his way to open up to you. But we have the Ace of Cups reversed. Actually, I only reverse three cards when I do the monthly and other readings. There's only certain decks I use where I reverse. But all three of my reversals came out that Five of Cups reverse, which is a good thing because that means he is coming out of some kind of sadness very soon. And the Ace of Cups was reversed and that Ten of Wands. The Ten of Wands reverse is kind of good because you're letting something go that was very stressful but yeah the ace of cups reversed i kind of have a feeling that yeah you have a couple of different options or you're keeping your options open there could be a couple of different people here maybe one's a go and one's a no i almost get that feeling one is a go one is a no and there's something else you're letting go of it's like the ending of this devil something toxic whether it's a person or a substance like smoking or something like that there's something about that you're not seeing yet and maybe you don't see just how toxic this person or the substance or whatever it's doing to your body or your soul your mind but with the world card and death i mean those are both like you know brand new beginnings springtime oh, it's not springtime now but the death card always reminds me of springtime winter is over and it's happy fresh spring around the corner so something's getting ready to end that's toxic with that six of cups here this almost looks like someone dreaming about someone or or maybe in their relaxed moments they're thinking someone's reminiscing about someone here's the the hangman the queen of cups and that three of wands i almost get like the feeling that guy is is relying on her Someone could be waiting for you or relying on you or you are their ship that comes in. They're, um, they're ready for something, ready for you. So there could be someone like waiting on you or relying on you. Someone you have memories with, someone you've been thinking about. They've been thinking about you. And after that King of Wands comes this Two of Wands. So someone could be coming back in your life or... But it's someone that looks like they're trying to let go of some grief. And after that, we have the the four of wands with him, connected to him after that five of cups reverse. So, yeah, it's like um, getting together after this guy goes through a, a sad period. And maybe that's why the ace of cups was reversed. Now, whoever's connected to this ace of cups reverse, it's almost like with these two cards connected to that, I kind of get a feeling of like they're feeling almost like a little bit arrogant, but they're on the, the defense too. It's like, uh, you know, pounding their fist on their chest like a baboon and yay, I win. But at the same time, and maybe that's what this forgiveness card was about was, I don't know, someone's got their guard up and is on the defense about maybe something you've said. Maybe your love life will be off just a little bit in August with those cards could be so that's about it in this section i think i'll lay out some more cards here see what other stories come up so this time it started off with the devil card followed by the nine of cups and these other ones which 
it uh, kind of looks like maybe some of you there's something you like to do I mean this may not be partying or drinking or anything like that it could be something you like to buy or go do or spend money on because it looks like you know this five of Pentacles is like the poor house so maybe there's something and some do with a loss of money or or not having enough or or this could be a person in your life that's a little bit toxic and they need help and they're afraid to ask for help but since this queen of cups came up again there's someone you love or you're you're having f some very emotional loving feelings probably with someone from your past or someone you have really good memories with there's a lot of reminiscing this next month of august and then we go from this eight of swords you know feeling trapped or or just feeling like you can't get out of a situation and then all of a sudden here comes the wheel of fortune the ace of cups up right here in the the eight of coins eight of pentacles so so for some of you it could be a new job that you're just going to love or it could be the new love that comes in is really going to be working well with you and putting in the effort in this relationship i don't know why this devil keeps coming up something toxic there the palace of swords i see the palaces as like a home and the swords is communication or ideas stuff like that could have something to do with a home like you're getting ready to i don't know not be able to pay the rent or something it's that five of pentacles is real close to that palace of coins so the overall feeling i get for you is like you're going to be in your heart space so the queen of cups is very loving the ace of cups came out twice so it might be a little wishy-washy maybe in love and there's something toxic here i don't know if that's a person or something else so taurus those are your readings for august 2022 and I'll see you guys next time.